Okay, welcome back. It's Mr. T here. Today, what we're going to do is try and make a cam follower on our automata base. So, what we're going to do, first of all, we need to have a look at the top surface, the one that we can't see from here. So, we need to whistle this around. Technical term there. And what we're going to do is create a new sketch. It's asking us what we're going to sketch on. We're going to sketch on this surface there. And we're going to create a circle. So, sketch and circle or we could just press C and we, I'm not going to stick it anywhere in particular I'm just going to click it there now the circle size we're going to use 6 mil dowel so I'm going to say make it 6.2 let's say that's just a little bit over press enter uh, next I'm going to hit D for dimension I'm going to dimension from the end of there to there. Remember this whole thing is 200 so I'm going to say 100 and up oh, 100. Let's try that again. Yes. And the next dimension is from the center there to the bottom and that's going to be 65 divided by 2 because I'm being lazy with my maths. 32.5. Yes, that's right. Once we've done that we stop the sketch uh, we can zoom in a little bit just to make sure that that looks good. Yes, it does. Now we're going to create an extrusion. And it's over here in the dialog box. It's asking us what to extrude. So I'm going to click on that. And I'm going to just drag that through a little bit. Okay, I think that's dragged 15. That's perfect. Notice down here it's saying cut. Click OK. I've now got a hole. So if I press the shift key and wheel mouse, I can just make sure that that goes through there and I'm making sure that it lines up to the cam which it doesn't quite line up but that's not too bad 